Isn't it, a, isn't it true, Alan, you can probably answer yeah. this better, but isn't it true that some people who do have problems and need other drugs actually are self-medicating with marijuana? Is that the people that are in that study? Well, often what happens is that people who don't have access to, for example, young males who are not in a public school setting where, ironically, think of the context we're talking about here. A third of males who are in the public schools consume a form of amphetamine for ADD and ADH. Uh, uh, right. Yeah. So, <clears throat> yes, many of those people who don't have access to those drugs legally are self-medicating with marijuana. And, now, and what, this, uh, there was a commenter who said that a lot of people <laughs> that stoners give people a bad name about about alcohol or I'm sorry about marijuana give people the bad idea about uh, marijuana, but that. There actually are a lot of people who are professionals like the two of you who are smoking in their homes on the weekends. Well, well no, uh, you, not you me, cannot. not this guy. <laughs> well, but let no, me just say Brian something. If I can be allowed to say one thing, maybe. Yeah, I, I love to chew tobacco. Now, let me just tell you something about the difference. We we have a long tradition in this nation of tobacco use. Yeah. We have a long tradition and, and a battle use. And over alcohol use. use. Now, and as a society, way, as a society, way, can I just yeah, finish go, maybe, sure. and then you can reply? Yeah. Now, as a society, we've drawn lines, and our lines are: we don't allow heroin use, we don't allow cocaine. We don't allow crystal meth, right. and we don't allow marijuana use. And right. to, uh, to open this door out in California is going to make our medicated society hey, even Brian, more medicated. Brian, can I get you back to reality? You know, the law didn't I'm allow... I'm in reality. Excuse me. Did the law allow black people to vote? Did the law allow women to be part of society? No, the law can be wrong, Brian. I can't believe you would hang the entire argument here, the fact that I'm saying law, we have the, the, traditions. We have oh, a yeah, tradition. By, by, and by, the I'm way, saying by the way, Brian, the traditions... Allows yeah, by the a way, lot of things that are bad that's for right. you. By I the agree, but that doesn't right. mean we should allow more things that are bad for you. Well, by the way, we're only now seeking to control something the government failed to control 73 years ago. But you speak of tradition. Hey, Brian, what did those founding fathers grow on those plantations, Brian? What did the Washington Tobacco. Post... Uh, no, excuse me. They grew hemp. The first order of commerce in this country was hemp. Right, but Brian, they, were Brian, they growing it to smoke, or were they, no, Helen, they, were they, they growing it to smoke, or were they actually growing it to make clothing? And, and they grew. They grew it for three reasons. They grew it for medicinal purposes. They put it in tinctures. They did grow it to smoke. We can see from the forensics of testing the pipes that they used that they did smoke it. But yes, pointedly, they used it mainly wow. for, in, for <laughs> industrial. Thomas Jefferson sitting around having I a toke in the evenings. Yeah. Well, by the way, you know, we, much, we, we, they might have never written. All the yeah. great well, documents well, they well, wrote well, in those federalist papers. Thankfully, they did write those papers, and blessedly, even the even the Declaration of Independence was written on hemp. You know that, Brian, don't you? <laughs> they didn't smoke it, thank goodness, or we wouldn't yeah. have it. Yeah. Well, okay. I mean, Wait a minute. Let, let me ask both of you. Let's talk about the economics of this. Is yeah. this actually is California, which is a cash-strapped state at the moment? Is California looking at legalizing marijuana so they can bring in that revenue? There is currently five states that are looking to legalize marijuana. Massachusetts, New Hampshire, Washington, Nevada, and California. Californians are going to vote on it. One out of eight Americans live in California. It is a country unto itself. And as Brian mentioned earlier, when Californians voted for medical marijuana in 1996, it changed everything. Now, 14 states in the District of Columbia have medical marijuana. So it passes prologue, Brian. I think you guys are going to lose on this topic, and we're going to have marijuana after California votes for it, it's going to happen all around the country. I'm well, not going to smoke. If we do, if we do, then America will lose because we're going to have a lot more drug sure. driving. We're going to have no, we people using a lot more drugs in the society. Thankfully, we won't. Gonna, you're gonna, no, is it possible though that the same people who drink alcohol marijuana. will then decide? Let me ask you, Brian. Is it possible that the same people who want to have a beer, want to have a couple of glasses of wine, a couple of shots of whiskey, that those are the same people that will then smoke pot as no, opposed see, to drinking? So you're not going to no. have more people. No, Driving these aren't impaired. mutually exclusive. They'll use them together, much no, like they many actually people don't. mix. No. Well, that's not well, true. Brian, I mean, Brian, you, you, you and I are both examples. Brian, from? you are saying you only use alcohol and tobacco, right? I use them sometimes at the right. same time. Right. Well, Brian, I don't use alcohol and tobacco, even though they're lawful, but I use cannabis. So I'm sorry. I think you're wrong when you say that people do these things collectively. You might choose to conflate your drugs. I just choose to use cannabis. 
Well, that you're, you're one example, my friend. But uh, you see a lot of people, and, and you see a lot of uh, examples, and, and we've seen this publicly of people drinking and using drugs and getting arrested, and they're mixing both Brian, of those drugs. Nobody's, yeah, but you see time. people drinking and so getting arrested too. Brian, that's Brian, what no you're other Brian, in there. Brian, what you're failing to do is make the distinction between the use of a substance and the abuse. You and I can readily agree nobody should be driving impaired on anything, whether it's legal or not. But it's in the par it's in the false paradigm that's saying that any use of marijuana, whether it's medicinal, whether it's industrial, whether it's an adult like me who pays a third of my taxes to the government, how could it possibly be that that government would violently come into my home in the middle of the night and well, try to wanna, stop me from I, engaging right, in a behavior I, that you actually does, engage in? Does that happen? People kicking down your door to see what you're smoking? Well, I thank, don't want to pay my my tax yes, dollars for Brian, Obamacare to pay for your health care problem. And by the way, Brian, you're every thirty all the Brian, time. Every you ruin your lungs. Brian, you mean like when you're smoking tobacco? Where, Brian, really? Brian, Brian you're real. saying you chew tobacco. You're not saying you I know, smoke. I, no. Yeah, you so you're not a smoker. Tobacco. Yeah, so Brian, okay, only, but so Brian only wants his teeth to fall out. No problem, Brian. Lose your teeth. My, okay. grandfa my grandfather can, can lost his teeth at 40 this, chewing bring tobacco. This back into a more reasonable area. I mean, right. Why are you, you a prohibitionist? Debate, uh, why, yeah. You're a prohibitionist, too. You're no. for prohibition of. Uh, of heroin and all these other drugs. That's right. Now, I am. now, who's in the mainstream of America? Me, who doesn't believe that marijuana should be uh, available for kids and, and adults. To I don't go think in it should be buy. for kids. Okay, I'm sorry. Let me take a step okay, back. Okay, but alcohol for adults is to alcohol walk in is legal and, and, and store it's not supposed. Kids aren't supposed to get it. ABC News Now. Good to know.